Hey guys, uh, welcome to another episode of Quick Jams, and I'm just playing a quick jam that I got with uh, my humble indie bundle. It was um, Thomas is alive. Thomas was alone. Thomas was alone. A weird first thought to have. And uh, yeah, I'm very excited about it um, because I like to play some indie games, and this gives me. Let me move my chair closer. It's gonna be a great opportunity to play a couple of indie games. So yeah, so far I've bought a whole bunch of things with the humble indie bundle. Boy. Yeah. So let's let's try this guy out. Let's see what happens. Thomas decided to start listing his observations for posterity. Nice VO. Nice. The whole alone thing. Two. Portals. They led somewhere. He'd yet to work out where. Three, falling. Thomas was absolutely fantastic at falling. He was almost as good at falling as he was at observing. <laughs> okay, interesting. Thomas couldn't fall past this block. Think, damn it, think. What? If there was some kind of inverted fall. Some way to... What's the word? Jump. It worked! Thomas had solved the great... Okay, I'm using a game controller. But Thomas noted there was no real danger in missing it. The world didn't want him to fail here. It was pushing him, but gently. This really feels nice, I must admit. This all seemed a little dangerous. The world was not to be trusted. It was unstable, and it seemed to Thomas that it could let him down at any moment. Yay! I like this music. Pretty nice. Level 0.6. Thomas wondered whether the portals were actually taking him anywhere. He felt like he was making progress, but... Yeah! might have been paranoia again, but Thomas could have sworn the world was becoming more complicated. It always seemed to be one step ahead of his skills. Oh, damn. Designed just for him. He wondered why. Was the world testing him? Oh, too obvious. So much fun. Something about the boiling, toxic, glowing water intimidated Thomas. He didn't like it. He certainly didn't want to swim in it. He made another mental note. Four, water. Not good to be avoided. This is so cool. Trick jump. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> The loneliness was getting to Thomas. No amount of observation or obsessive note taking could combat that. I'm not taking any notes. Oh, this is so cool! It really does feel incredible. It's something that's difficult to explain, but it really does feel beautifully smooth. Very responsive. I mean, just you saw. How accurate. Thomas had a new theory. The world was training him. He could feel himself getting smarter. There was the Oops. mental list to consider. Over the minutes and seconds since his spontaneous generation, he'd become a pretty skilled jumper. Yep, I'm becoming pretty skilled. He just wished he had someone to share it with. Come on. This would happen. Overlapping scripts, more than one AI was bound to be spawned into an environment at some point. Turns out I understand. Hold on, are we? Uh, to be honest with you, I don't know anything. Chris took an immediate and deep dislike to the skinny red rectangle. Who the hell did this Thomas think he was? 
So I can swap characters and get them into different holes? Chris had been Oops. doing fine. He wasn't the highest jumper, but he'd held his own. He'd even been graceful at times. Well, not actually... Not technically graceful. It's probably, probably the wrong word, but, you know, fine. There was that skinny little runt leaping about like he owned the place. It, it feels... I, th I don't anything about this game. Whoa! I don't anything about this game, but it makes me—it gives me the impression that we're busy. We're polygon in a game or something, like that? or like a like this guy's busy making a game. And you can swap. I use the right bumper to swap. Not really. Oh, you know what? Oops. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up. I don't want the, oh, this thing must go away. What is it? That was a very simple puzzle. Although, yeah, a lot of fun. Ooh. In a weird way, I feel I get that sense. Okay. This was more like it. The glowy white thing. Only Chris could get to it. Which of course made it all the more enticing. Oh. What would it do? What new opportunity might this switch open up to him? Oops. I'm gonna do it. Is it? Is it how I'm gonna do it? Grace, Grace. Another chance for Thomas to jump slightly higher than Chris. Oh. Seriously, this made the whole switch pressing thing entirely worthwhile. Do not do this right. Come on, Grant. Rewarding. I feel like um, even though it's not that complicated, I feel like I've accomplished something. Was this good? Because on the surface, it did not seem good. Chris was pretty scared. Little Red seemed fine, happy to be on his merry little adventure. Chris couldn't shake the feeling that things had taken a significant turn for the worse since Thomas had joined him. Oh. Sure, he'd been able to piggyback his way to ever so slightly higher platforms, but where had that got him? Well, to ever so slightly higher platforms, which was sort of his point. Hmm. You know what? Ah, oh, damn it, Grant. I need to jump on. thing to disappear this Q E L button R button scroll characters I know how to do it I think yeah. oh man damn see hold on let me work out if this is the only time I'm gonna need him nope I'm gonna need him Introduce other shapes soon. Level two. Thomas, with pure hatred, he seemed so very happy at their situation. 
friends together, a brave fellowship of quadrilaterals on a quest for greatness. Yeah. Well, that would be fine. But it was all the obvious observation that Thomas was doing which grated. Every time they saw something vaguely new, Chris would hear a satisfied little hmm from the vaulting idiot. There's a little bit of a plot going there. Uncle would split them up. If only for a few levels. Oops. There we go. Let's go. Oh, Flip, you really, really... This game is this game is incredible actually. Okay, let's do this guy first. Yeah. So who's Chris? I think this guy's Chris. Ooh, <laughs> nearly died. Okay, on, let's do this. Yeah! That's what's up. Yeah, a lot of fun, man. I, I, I don't know what to say about this John as we play. Knew. He knew that this was his chance. A moment to shine. This was game day. Would not do. John needed room to show off his exceptional skills. As it was, he was trapped on the wrong side of these little dot things. John, Chris, from anyway. Yeah, very cool game. That's all I can say. It's a very cool time. I like the way it feels. I like the way it's so chilled. John inhaled the air of the open space, and it smelled of awesome. Huh? Time to flex those muscles, to put his training to use time to show those little dots how it was done. I'm gonna make this gap. It's gonna be a bit of a large. No. I got a feeling this guy can't really jump. For oh wow! No jokes. This guy can. John decided to press the switch to let the little dots catch up with him. John cared for his new allies. You could tell from the sympathetic expression he practiced in the mirror all these years. John was insincere. Chris, you can do it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Life's about working together, guys. That's what this game's all about, really. Here we go. There we go. Yay! Come, Chris, you can do it. Okay, let's... Seems a little obvious. It was obvious until I <laughs> until I said it was obvious. Now how would I do this? Are you... Okay, guys, off. Let this dude the potato chip happy to keep helping. He felt it was important to his image that he was seen to help the little guys. No man, what a twerk. either. The red one, Thomas, had a charming way of applauding every time John jumped. Okay. I don't know if this is going to work. Yeah! Oh, what? Oh, no, really. Come, 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 come. Actually, not gonna help either. Oh, you all have to come down. What atrocious! What is that? I jump. Hex. Yeah. Close to getting them all on in one go. Okay, come, McDonald's potato chip, you can do this. Okay. So very accurate at jumping, it's so like it. So nice. Oh shit, it's oh no! The frustration is large! Oh. 
Come on. Okay, you can do this, man. You can do this. We're here, we're here, we're here together. We, we're here as a family. No, 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 no. Oh, really? Oh. Come on. Come on, I'm ready, I'm ready for it. Yeah. You, 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 okay, you, we're ready for this, all the way, all the way, there we go, I actually don't know if this guy's gonna make it, yeah, he does have any plug, okay, the same story here, right, oh no, wait. Okay. Okay, you can do this. Let's finish this level and wrap this up because I think we get a good gist of this game, but I really like it. I think it's really cool. The orange one was less immediately likable, but his unremitting cynicism and tutting amused John. So weird how these guys have characters and personalities, but they're just cubes. I feel like I know them. Something I didn't think I would have before. Whoops. Oh, you can do this. Ah. I think I'm going by the book here. I'm sure that there are more creative and interesting ways to do these puzzles. Never mind. There we go. Blink. Yay! Excellent. Right. A floating target. This would require coordination, balance, and timing. Alright, I think, okay, that's gonna be it for me. Thank you guys for watching. This is great. We're, we, we're nearly done with this section anyway. I think this is a really cool, a really cool game. Oh, wow, check this. Yeah! I think it's a very cool game. Thomas is alive. Thomas was alone. Is alive. <laughs> One of the two, you'll find it in the title and in the description. Um, it's in the Humble Indie Bundle, you can buy it from Steam, and I don't think you should actually wait if you can't get it. Uh, in time, get it. This is such a rad game. It's the first time I've played this game, and I'm... I'm be playing a little bit more. Um, in the meantime, you can just, like, yeah, go go buy it and go get it yourself. I love how accurate this is. Let me do some trick jumping here. Oops. Yeah, it's great. It's a very cool game. Okay, guys, hey, hey, check you in the next video. Make sure to, if you like Dodo, check out my Dodo videos. And uh, yeah, I think that uh, I'll check you guys soon, hopefully with another quick jam. In the meantime, cheers, bye.